I really want to redo my bathtub area and give it a little bit more personality since it's just become like a graveyard for plants. So today I'm going to show you how I DIY'd a corner caddy to give it some tumbler inspo. First thing I did was clear off the corner, then measure it to know how big I can make my triangle. I could make it 21 and a half inches on two sides by 31 inches on the longer side. I decided to cut out a template of those measurements with some scrap cardboard I had on hand. That way it was easy for me to build around it and it was a quick reference. I'm very visual and hands-on, like measuring stuff and not having a template to go off of, my brain gets a little screwy. With that template, I could easily put my wood around it, mark the measurements needed. I'm gonna make three base pieces out of this two by four that you see. I'm gonna cut that down to be two inches thick by 31 inches long, and then two pieces, two inches thick by 21 and a half. You can make this any sort of thickness you want on top for like the tabletop to be essentially, or like the corner caddy top. But I had scrap pieces of wood that were two inches thick, so I decided to just cut those down to cover the entire top of the triangle and leave a little space in between. I marked how long I needed the pieces to be to cover the entire top and used my pinky as a reference for spacing in between the pieces. When you're unsure of freehand marking like you saw me do earlier, just take out your measuring tape and make sure you have the appropriate length for each little slat going down the triangle. Once I had all my top pieces cut out, I just put those to the side and then put my template on top of the triangle and marked the angles I needed to cut on my table saw to make this triangle base flush. Even with the template on hand, I managed to mess up. So I cut this piece a little too short. I'm just gonna add a little extra wood piece and screw it all together when we put the base together. So you'll need your power drill, wood glue, and some wood screws. I attached the corners by pre-drilling some holes and then just putting some wood glue on the pieces that are gonna be smushed together and screwing the wood screw directly into it. With this messed up piece, I wasn't too concerned because you're not going to be able to see it up against the bath and with the top on it. Once my base was put together, I just put a long strip of wood glue at the end and started with the largest piece of the triangle. That way I knew it was straight and hammered in each side. I then spaced it just by looking at it and repeated the process, gluing along the edges and hammering where it connects. I just worked with the largest to the smallest piece and then the very tip of the triangle was a little baby piece, but we're gonna deal with that a little later. I flipped it upside down and I trimmed the excess off the edge with my table saw. Now it is time to smooth out the edges, so I just took my orbital sander and went ahead with some 120 grit and did that. I also used my wireless sander to sand down the top, and then for the sides, the smaller pieces, I used this little gator dude. It's like this tiny sandpaper for hard to reach areas. I added a dab of glue and a little corner piece to top this triangle off, and it's done and ready to stain. I did cover up the larger holes with wood filler and sand it down once it was dry, and then I went ahead and took my favorite stain and just applied it everywhere in every nook and cranny. I shellacked it per the instructions on the can and let that dry and now I have a beautiful corner caddy to style. Styling it is not as easy as it looks on Tumblr. It definitely took a little bit of method to my madness and trial and error until I got it. This was the perfect project to like start my inspiration to redo my bathtub area. And if you guys wanna see a tour of how I did it for paying absolutely nothing, give this video a thumbs up. As always, thank you guys for watching. I hope you enjoyed this week's DIY. I will see you Sunday for a special one.